Yo, what's up? Welcome back to Alpha Central, I'm your host Jack, and today we found the best moments when women get rejected. Now, let's jump right in, right after you subscribe, of course. Disclaimer, this video was made for strictly comedic slash artistic purposes. No offense is intended towards any individual featured in this video. Mia, would you say you're a smart individual? Yes. Yes, I like the confidence behind that. Let's get straight to the point. If 6 plus 7 is 12, what's 7 plus 6? 12. That is correct. That was good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Do you know what's funny? She counted it, but it was actually wrong. What's 7 plus 6? 13. Uh, that's correct, yeah. What's 18 percent of 100? 8. That is correct. How did you figure it out, though? I don't know, I just guessed. Oh, well, great, that was wrong. I'm pretty sure it was right. No, that was wrong, that was wrong. Yeah. Is China and Tokyo or is Tokyo in China? They're both in Europe. <laughs> There's no way you just said that. Wait. Before you say anything else, did you hear why I asked you? <laughs> Is Tokyo in China or is China in Tokyo? Yes. But, but yeah. Tokyo is the capital of China. I'm confused right now, I can't lie, but that's that's correct. Proud of you, man. Proud of you, man. If we're both in a race and I'm in second position and you pass me, what position are you in now? If I'm second, no, if you're second yeah. and I'm behind you yes. and I overtake you, yes. that puts me in a first position. That is wrong. It's honestly crazy how little knowledge some of these people have. You would think school taught them most honest is the best thing to do. Saves the other person from heartbreak. The best way to get out of a date before it's happened. Just get really hammered at the bar and take your pants off. I'm sorry, I might have misheard that. I get super hammered. Boom, 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 rapid fire, and then pants off. I mean, they're gonna avoid you, so. No, at all costs, I think. <laughs> I'm sorry, what did he just say? Is he for real or do I need to get my ears checked again? You try and make out this yogurt is the most evil thing that anyone Piers, can in the world. I think you're bonkers, Piers, Juliet. we're in the sixth mass extinction. We're living it now. You're behaving like a news anchor. On, I mean, you're behaving like a news anchor on what the film. Don't look up. What we're in the sixth mass extinction. You're deflecting all the time from the The world is not going to end you because I... You are trying to deflect Because I eat a mother yogurt. Look, what? Animals are factory farmed. You're trying to deflect look, from the fact... The world's still here. Veganism protects the environment. Juliet, we're still here. Rubbish. Most of the bees get killed in the pollination process. Rubbish. And by the way, after they get killed, you vegans get all your almonds and avocados flown over on these gas-guzzling planes. And my point is, I like to fly, I like to eat meat, I like to eat yogurts. I'm just fed up with vegans trying to shame me for it when you're all such hypocrites no. when it comes to the bees. Hey, there's nothing wrong with being vegan, but she just went way over the top with it. If you have to describe yourself as a car, what car would you be? Well, I drive a Cadillac. What type of Cadillac? I don't even know what XDS. My dream car is a Rolls Royce. Rolls Royce? Yeah. Well, I would say like, you give me the, the Ford Bronco that OJ was driving. I would say that. Ooh. And then, I think for you, you're like a, like a 05 Ford Ex Expedition. Expedition. <laughs> I'm just being honest. They were not happy with their car comparisons, I'll tell you that. The amazing thing about YouTube is if you go down here to library and you go to history, you can see what your wife's interested in, how to lighten between the cheeks. Andrew, stop! Why are you- <laughs> No, how did you see it? Well, she got caught in 4K here. Must have been embarrassing. The insult is, like, why are you interviewing people on 6th Street right now? I don't understand. I love to interview girls with an IQ less than 100. You can't figure out why we're interviewing on 6th Street. She tried throwing shots, so he got her right back. Hopefully her IQ was high enough to process it. What's your biggest ick in a girl? Think that she could get whatever she wants. She gotta earn it. Okay. Too many Too many What do you mean? Too many but like she's had too many? Too many Relying on me for your happiness and not being happy with yourself. And too many Dang, the guy in the middle only had one thing to say. She had to hear it again. Okay, to see if girls are tough. Did you just see someone run that way? Run that way? I mean, I saw someone in the yellow hoodie run that way. Yeah, yeah just go check. Yeah, I'm not, yeah, I'm not. I'll go check. Yeah, yeah, bro. Damn, they didn't realize it was me, huh? Damn, I'm a professional prankster now. God damn. I should check out my YouTube video. Oh, you found it. Yeah. Damn, he just he just disappeared like that. Dude, that's freaking wild. I just learned English, so I have a hard time like understanding what you're saying a little bit. Oh, okay. yeah. So you're gonna have to like use Google Translate or something. I don't know. Oh, okay. Yeah, bro. Wait. You're using Google Translate? Yeah. Yeah, just like just like put English and then translate it to like um. Dinglish. English? English or Dinglish? Yeah. English. Okay, I... Yeah, I'm just kidding. There's a camera over there. You see it? Oh. That was me! 
How did they not notice it was him? Either he has some secret we don't know about, or they might need to get their brains checked for parasites. Fatty, who was called Fatty because he's fatty, is now known as Freddy, even though he's still fat. And you call somebody by their name, which is Frank, John, Paula, or Alex. You don't call them Spotty. You don't call them Fatty. You don't call them Fatty. You call them by their name. We're now in a world where Cosmopolitan Magazine, one of the most influential magazines for young women in this country, puts a £305 model on the front cover and doesn't mention anywhere in the text that this is morbidly obese and very dangerous. Uh it's said we celebrate being incredibly fat. But if you dare to use the word fatty in the beano about a fictitious character all hell breaks loose the sensitivity police get called in it all has to be changed i mean he does have a good point but she isn't wrong either all right what's your biggest ick in a girl when she got guy friends you know she got guy friends yeah somebody dirty and they be like they be trying to creep up on like so i be keeping them away so if you got a girlfriend out there and she got a best friend he gotta go where she gotta go one of the two I gotta say, I'm gonna have to second that. She got a guy best friend. If he's not gay, she gotta go. She's, yeah, she gotta go. Yeah, the guy friends are always a bit suspicious. You gotta wonder what they really want. This is gonna be so funny. Was that you? Huh? Was that you? What do you mean? Give me my hat back. What, what hat? You took your hat. You threw it. I have a hat in my hand. Where's my hat? <laughs> Dude, in the sweater. Where did he go? I don't speak English. Oh. I'm sorry. Oh. Yeah, yeah. Where did go? Uh, I can help you look. Can I see it? Yeah. Yeah, it was me. The ending was absolutely golden. He had them both so fooled. Wearing my wife's face all over me in public to get her reaction. All right, honey, let's go. No, no, Why? Because <laughs> my face over you. I want to show you off to the world, and I don't care who sees it. Grab your purse, Buttercup. We're leaving. <laughs> Please change out of that. Honey, I'm gonna shop till I drop in these things. <laughs> Stop it. Why did you have to wear this out in public? Because I love you. And I must declare it. <laughs> what are you doing? So, why are you embarrassed? Here, take because this. Because you are wearing my face over you and people laughing at us. <laughs> We're gonna buy this and change the set. I refuse. <laughs> Let's get inside. <laughs> this is my wife and I'm not ashamed. <laughs> Something about this video is so wholesome. I hope this couple lives happily. When the kitty stank. Well, sometimes it smells too bad for us to continue. Nothing wrong with that. Would you guys date a plus size girl? No. Yeah. Hey man, it's not about the image, it's about the heart. No. Exactly. Yeah. Preach, my friend in the back. <laughs> That's why you're saying that. You're spot. What are you saying? Shut up. Looks like guys will have something new to argue about for years. As a dead got off work, bro. It's five in the morning. I work graveyard. And my ex is literally here, bro. Look, there's a security right here, and that's her car leaving right now, bro. Look at that. That's her license plate, right here. This is my, this is her, bro. Dude, I just got a gun. Hold on. Weirdo, psycho, pulling up to my job, and I'm dead at being. Followed. You see that car right there? Yeah, that's my ex's car. All right, fuck. And she's just following me and shit. Look at this. She's blocking my car. Look at this. Look at this. You're blocking my car. You're blocking my car. You are blocking my vehicle and stalking me. Leave me alone. You are stalking me. You just showed up at my job at five in the morning. I'm tired. Go away. Dude, you're insane. How did, how did you find my job? Dude, get away from me. Get away from me. Dude, this is literally, dude, I'm gonna die, bro. 
I'm dead. It's gonna die one day, bro. This is literally insane. Dude, I don't know. I don't know what's wrong with her, bro. Now this is just out of this world creepy. He might need a restraining order. Who's smarter, men or women? Wait, really? That's what I have to answer? It depends on the subject. Okay, math. Okay, that's... Uh, I'm gonna go with women. What's seven times eight? Wait, well, how do I not know this? All right, now you ask me. Nine times 13. 117. She just proved herself wrong, on camera. How embarrassing is that? Oh, okay, now she can see only after she gets robbed in pure daylight. What would you rate me on a scale of 1 to 10? Like an, an 8. An 8? Yeah. Appreciate that, okay. I like it for snobby though, that's a 10. Okay. Would you give me a 360 really quick? Okay. i give you a good, like, 7. It's because I'm not from here. I'm from Denver. Oh, there's very attractive people here in Arizona. There's some attractive people in Denver, I think. I don't know, I've never been. You're right. Okay, actually, you have to explain why I'm a 7. A 7? Yeah, you have to explain now, because now I'm feeling... Like you're not an eight of a That's not good. Why am I a seven? Um, you had a little more. My yeah, if, if you had a little bit more, then I would have gave you like an eight. But the petite style, you like, you have like a cute vibe. It's Cause you're black and girls have some big old booties. <laughs> that has nothing to do with That's it. That's absolutely everything. Nothing to do with it. I feel like I have a cute actually. Look, I can work with it. You're good. Okay, get my number. By the time I'm done with you, it'll be big. Didn't think we were together at the get time. The out of my face, don't push me. Don't push me. That's what happens when you can only Ask your best friend. He's the one who told me. He's the one that told me. Where are you going? He's the one. Okay, bye. You're walking home. Call your own $130 Uber. Bye. Yeah. Embarrassing, right? All that I bought you on you. All that Take off your shoes. Take off your shoes. Take the hat off, take the shirt off, right? Yeah, take it off, because I bought it all, you dumbass. Have her buy it, have her buy it. Have fun with the blondes. Bye. Bye. Get the back here, you know I didn't mean that. I was drunk as shit. Shut I don't the I don't give a up. Say it to the camera. I didn't. You see it too. Oh, you don't know her? Yeah, yeah, that's what I thought. Katie, he's all yours, buddy. He's all yours. All yours. Nah. Wow, the amount of disrespect he must have had to cheat on her with an OnlyFans model? That's cold. Haha, <laughs> you're going to jail. Cheyenne How? here's your license. I have never seen anyone react like she did. It looks like this couple is done for good. Oh, he gone, he leaving, he's leaving her. Oh my God, f you. Oh! Damn. Damn. Oh. He love her though. He love her. Look. Come back. Come back, bro. You gotta come back. Ah! This n <laughs> Damn. Watching people break up in public like this is truly heartbreaking. There's always that one girl who thinks that everyone wants her. This guy's reaction when she sits down like that was just too good. He simply got up and left. What a savage. You guys have made it to the end. Like and subscribe to prove you're an alpha. And remember, according to YouTube, the best way to help the channel and the algorithm is to watch another one of my videos right after this video. So if you like this video, you should watch another one. Till next time.